What is going on, girls, guys, and all other forms of life? My name is whatever you want to call me, and welcome to PUBG, or Player Unknown Battlegrounds. Now, I'm not into a lot of FPS games, I'm more into team based games, such as Dead by Daylight, for instance. And it just so happens that PUBG and Dead by Daylight are going through a collaboration effort, and there's a new game mode in this game where you can basically play Dead by Daylight in PUBG. And I'm kind of loving it. The only reason I like it so much is because you have the old generator repair animations, the ones that came from 2016. We'll play Survivor first, which I've done before. And just so you know, this is incredibly buggy, and, and, and the skill checks are horrendous. I'm not a fan of the way they work at all. So we will, we will try, um, we will try Survivor first, which I've done, and I escaped last round. I wanted to test out the game a few times to see how it works. And, okay, so yeah. And then there, there's Killer, which we'll try on next round, which I have not tried, so we'll do it in the game. And it looks like the Killer is supposed to be based off of Death Slinger. Uh, attack survivors using a Win 94 and machete. Uh, carry the lock. Carry and lock survivors in blue zone locker for a trial. Okay, so pretty much instead of hooks, this game uses lockers, and you cannot hide in lockers. But that's where the that's where the killer is supposed to supposed to put the survivors. Yeah, so this is basically what it looks like. And I designed my character to look as close to Nia Carlson as possible because she's the poster girl for Dead by Daylight. And here's the palettes. I've noticed that they're weird. They go down on their sides instead of going down on their face like they do in the regular game. And another strange thing I've noticed is they have the new generator models, but in-game, as you'll see, um... It'll do the 2016 repair animation. And another weird thing is you'll spawn in with a med kit. I think you can switch to another item, but I'm not sure how. Yeah, see? Or no, I have a grenade this time. The first two times I spawned in, I had a med kit. And the, the controls for this game are absolute ass, but look, it's press F to repair generator, and I'm not a fan of this. But I, yeah, look at the old generator animation. I should know, because I've actually memorized the way this looks. Looks like this guy is using a toolbox. <laughs> okay, so what's weird is this game acts like Huntress Lullaby. The um, the skill check notification will come before the skill check. You see? Okay, there it is. And then a solid five seconds later, the skill check shows up. I mean, I get it. It's a warning, but at least skill checks are like a second before Dead by Daylight. It took me so long to figure out genuinely how this game works. I would be fucking up the skill checks left and right, but now that I understand how it works, I've been hitting them pretty successfully. Uh, throw! Throw the thing! Do it! Uh, well, I fucked that one up, and it looks like they did use the, uh, vaulting animations from the game. Uh, pallet, let's go! Did I hit him? Yeah. No, nope, I got hit. Why can't I move? Oh, I guess he just, like, slammed me into the fucking thing. Okay, these skill checks are hard to hit. It's really hard. But it looks like he's letting me go for whatever reason. Jesus Christ, these are hard to hit. Okay, get up! Vault! Or not, because he's in the way, I guess. Get him! Oh, okay, that stunned him. Okay. Oh, but I'm all out now. I have no items anymore. <coughs> and another thing I like about this game is you can run while crouched, so basically you can just be a little shit and run around like this. But they also made it so that the characters, like, do grunts of pain. And they also gave the Dead by Daylight the newer animations for when you're injured. I would have liked it if they had given, like, the, the limp run from the original. Hey, do you want to touch my ass for a sec? Wanna heal me? Best buddy? Oh, thank you. <coughs> Wait, did I just get a skill Oh no, that was a gen. 
I thought I was getting his skill check notification. Thank you, buddy. And you can there is nods in this game. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I see the aura of chests. And that's the same color as Identity V, which I don't know if that's intended. Uh, there's like the there's the looter perk and the, and there's jumping. My mind is completely scattered, but I mean, this isn't the color of Plunderer's Instinct and Dead by Daylight. This is the color of that one perk in Identity V that lets you see the chests around you. <coughs> I'm praying for a med kit. Okay, I also noticed this. These toolboxes have fucking 200 charger charges. Okay, unless I'm nuts, that's the Dead by Daylight vault animation. I'll show you what I'm talking about when I find something to jump over. You know what? We'll just drop this damn pallet down. Die, bitch. I am still not used to that going sideways. I'm used to it going face down. Okay, but look at these animations. Tell me that's not Dead by Daylight inspired. Or actually just, like, stolen. It's either inspired or completely stolen. Okay, yeah, that was totally it. What was that? Oh, the gen's done. I spent so much time assing around, I can get the gate open now. <coughs> Hello, ma'am, you don't have leader, do you? And they also made it so your heads turn around and stuff, like in, you know, dead by daylight. Oh, also the first time I heard that, like the foghorn, that scared the shit out of me. But as you can see, we escaped. The killer didn't do too great. Let's see what our team is up to. Oh no, it was just YOLO uwu. <coughs> cool. So we did that. We're the best. But yeah, so obviously I'm never touching this fucking game again after I play killer. I'm gonna turn it off. Well, of course, after I get the, the Dead by Daylight code for Dwight, which I so know how to do, I, I've done more than two rounds. That was like my third or fourth. Two rounds completed. Uh, oh. I did more, Dankeschön. Thank you very much, ma'am, sir, ma'am. Ma'am, sir. I still don't know how this works. It, I, I saw somebody like recording a video for it. But it made absolutely no sense to me, so we'll just try that shit again some other time. <coughs> and another thing I cannot, for the life of me, figure out. Okay, see, I put it on, right? Okay, so we'll, we'll put on this too. Yeah, well, look, 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 look. We'll put on all this shit. Feet. The boots. Legs. Got right? Okay. So that's how my character looks right now. But it doesn't stay. It doesn't stay like that is the thing. Can I like... I want it to stay like that, but it goes back to default. What am I doing wrong? I honestly have no idea what I'm doing wrong. How do I get this to go away? No, I want this. How do I get the fucking check mark to go away? No, I want that. But I, I don't know how to get it to stay. Because it just goes away every time. I mean, I don't really care, because I'm never going to play this fucking game again. But I don't, I don't know why it does that. <laughs> okay, tell me my character does not look like Neil Carlson, and I'll tell you you're lying. Okay, show me your fucking website. Three rounds completed. How many do I have to complete? Whatever, it doesn't matter. But we'll try Killer for the video. I haven't tried it yet, so I don't really know how it works. I mean, survivors seem pretty overpowered in this version. <coughs> this is literally just old Dead by Daylight. Except, you know, in this game, people have flash grenades they can throw at you. Actually, I guess they have flash grenades in DVD if you, if you were to run, uh... 
if you were to run flashbang, but that's not what we're talking about here, best friend. We're talking about other shit, bro. Oh god, get, look, there's two people queuing up for, uh, for killer. Could you imagine if there's two killers versus this one dude? <coughs> god, that would suck so much. I, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, again, I'm sorry, this, this, like, waiting period. And, and it's weird, because, like, an, in, like, indeterminate of, uh... Oh, oh, sorry, I got lost. Uh, indeterminate of how many players are in the lobby, I think it will start anyways. Because I did a game that was a 2v1, and then I did a game that was a 4v1. And now I'm wondering if this game will be a 2v2, because there are two people who loaded for each class. <clears throat> but we'll never fucking know. And I, don't, and I don't know what any of this means. I have absolutely no idea what any of that means. Attack a survivor using a Win 94 and a machete. Okay, so press and hold the attack button until you lock your aim and to fire. Better for long range usage. Uh, press and hold the attack button to attack your target. Useful when attacking your target when in close range. You cannot throw this weapon. Wait, did I select killer? Let me look. Yes, I selected killer. But it still shows me as a survivor for whatever reason. <laughs> oh, this dude looks like he's gonna dick me around. Oh. Really? I guess it is random. Okay, you know what? We're gonna leave this round. We're gonna leave this match. Yeah, I'm chickening it. I wanna be the killer! I'm not chickening out. I just wanna be the other class, damn it. Chickening out my ass. What are you talking about? That looks like Fangman. <coughs> Chickening out my ass. I wanted to be the killer. Thank you very much. Okay, so I think this is supposed to be Dwight. This is supposed to be Fang. This is supposed to be. F oh no, this is Dwight. This is Meg. This is Fang, obviously. You can tell. I love that skirt, by the way. That's so cute. And, uh, that kind of looks like Leon. Which, I don't know. Shut up. It just does. <clears throat> Load me this killer, damn it! Is it hard? Oh, he's yellow. Does that mean that he's probably going to be the killer? I mean, our killer lobby is just impossible to get. It might just be that they're impossible to get, and I'll be stuck as Survivor for forever. Uh, if this doesn't work, we'll leave one more time and we'll requeue. But if it if it just continues to not work, then we'll we'll give up and uh, we'll give up. But I, I would really like to be the killer this round. Yeah, role selection. I clicked killer. Oh, I can switch. No, I want to be the killer. But there's fucking two of us here. Because I guess we all want something. <laughs> you can throw the med kits to disorient the killer. Look at this. Uh, enable self heal speed boost and increases the healing speed of others. Can be thrown to disorient the killer. Could you just uh, could you imagine throwing a toolbox or uh, like a med kit, just like hoisting it up and like full sending it like a football right into the killer's face? That would be kind of funny, I think. <coughs> oh, it's playing killer lobby noises. Maybe that means I'll be killer this round. Probably get my fucking ass handed to me. C Cause Survivor's too easy. Really? Again with this? Yeah, we'll try and Riku one more time. But yeah, that this I just I just pointed at my screen because you couldn't see my mouse. That character right there is I like that. You know, I would buy it if I gave a damn about this game. But this character right here, 
Damn! Does the same shit over and over. Alright, let's go! Make me kill her! For the fucking gods! For God's sake! Make me kill her! 